Guys, uh, I filmed an 18 minute video the other night about this. It was a little too depressing. I don't know if I'm gonna put it up, but after 31 years, I should be rejoicing and full of gratitude, but it hurts to see uh, the store finally closing. The sign's coming down, huh, Dean? Yeah. Ronnie, you wanna grab it? We, uh, the downsize here in an attempt to keep the business going, but the guy that has been running it for me for the last five years, Efren Muffer on a position he couldn't refuse. So we had downsized from 7,500 square feet. We had this massive facility over here, which we moved out of, um, I don't know, three months ago. At one point we had these two stores on the sides, uh, 61, 63, and 65. Anyway, any event, we're down to this one space, third, 1991. 31 years, man. John Lee, how many, how many years you been here? 15. 15 years. Your, your son was two years old when you started here. 1991. John, John's actually coming to the bike shop with us and he's gonna, we're gonna teach it. He's an electrical engineer, so we're gonna teach him the finer art of motorcycle wiring and uh, motorcycle restoration and we'll try to find a new career for him there. He's probably tired of working on computers anyways, huh? So yeah, we uh, 35,000 homes. 35,000 homes, 35,000 families, some of them three generations we served here. In fact, over 1,200 small businesses. I don't, think there's a, I don't think there's a company in the area that we haven't fixed their computer or got them a keyboard or something. All this stuff's getting thrown out. This is probably the sixth or seventh trailer load of shelves and tools and everything we're bringing out here. It is packed full, 36 foot trailer, floor to ceiling. And we filled, I don't know, uh, three 30 yard dumpsters full of stuff and we still got more over here. But this chapter is closed in the words of the Vikings, when they go to conquer a new land, they say, burn the boats. So there's, there's no option, burn the boats. Burn the boats. This boat is burned. You know, I haven't been here for 10 years, so it's a miracle that survived this long. I guess it's a testimony to the client base and, and the staff that ran it that could keep it floating this long, but it just became not economically feasible to keep it running and we couldn't get a team to, to run it. And Taylor and J Junior and Jordan, the, the, none of the kids wanted it. So it's closed today. In the words of Jesus, when he was on the cross, it is done. So the motorcycle business is taking all, all of my time. I've been extremely busy and just no time to nurture this business and absentee owners don't fly in small business. 31 years, I've seen a lot of people come and go here. That used to be a Ford dealer over there, now it's a Nissan. I feel like Clint Eastwood in Gran Torino where he's getting older and everything he knew is gone. My doctor was taken over by some youngster, some young lady, and uh, my dentist is gone, and pretty much everybody ran the town, and I don't know. A lot of people I, I grew up with are dead, 57. Certainly grandparents, great grandparents, parents. So life is short. You gotta do what you love to do, and that's what I'm doing with the motorcycle business. I, nothing I'd rather do than be there, and I'll spend the rest of my life doing that. In the words of Jim Carrey, you can fail doing something you don't want to do, so why not try something you love? And that's what I'm doing, and we're not gonna fail. We're kicking butt with your support. Every one of you guys that sends a client to us or buys a motorcycle or somehow supports the channel, buys a raffle ticket, or just subscribe to the channel and hit the like button. It all adds up. Thanks for watching and God bless America. Just one more sign to take down and then we're gonna come clean up the mess outside tomorrow and it's over. So this is gonna free me up even more to focus on my true love, motorcycles. Sold 680 motorcycles last year alone. This year, even more, especially with the Gas Gas franchise and all the good things going on. So stay tuned, lots of great things to come. Bitch. Spot him, spot him. Get in there, Dean. Back up, back spot him, spot him, spot him. Watch him. Shatter in your face, though. We're good.
Ronnie don't care. Oh yeah, nice. Wow, you even saved it. Yeah, let's bring that to the mill and put Kaplan, <laughs> Kaplan cycles on it. What'd you say, Ronnie? No, it looks like every other strip mall. Dang. Oh, Ain't boy, that the trick? 